I get my ready prompt. No, I'm not ready. <laughs> no, I, I just, let's go. Okay. My name is Darwin Sinoy, and I have spent about 20 years at the CMV prompt, 15 years with PowerShell, or I'm sorry, 15 years with um, uh, VBScript and Bash, and uh, five years with PowerShell. I want to tell you about the parts of PowerShell that make me more productive every day. My father is a mechanic and works on uh, machines where he has to com grease complex machines. Um, his hack allows him to do that in safety, comfort, and without any, having any more machine downtime. And while he hacks on machines, his goal is productivity. His own, his teams, and his companies. And his ideas about productivity are locked up inside of my soul as well. So I believe that productivity matters the most, and PowerShell puts my productivity front and center. So I want to show you some of the ways that it does that. First of all, let's talk about the productivity of the mind. As an instructor, I've made many student exercises. At one point, I decided it was a good idea to have variable substitutions to reduce the maintenance of the exercises. The, the, the consequences to student learning were catastrophic as they labored to understand the substitutions and keep them straight. I later learned that when you load down someone's thinking with useless information, it burns up those precious cycles that they need for comprehension. So cognitive loading matters when we handle technical tasks, and PowerShell does a good job of minimizing tech, uh, cognitive loading. English is a very hard to learn language due to its messy semantics and organic structures. Uh, when we will work with programming languages, we will deal with them very similarly in our mind in regard to semantics. Our mind can contain about five to seven things at a time when we're trying to process something. So if we have to have these uh, unnecessarily complex semantics and syntax, that taxes those resources and we have a harder time spending our focus on the problems at hand. We can't rally our mind's resources around it. So memorability matters, and PowerShell does a good job there. It used to be, in the last century, you'd have to learn most of your stuff on the front end of your career, but in IT, we have to relearn every day. I've heard estimates that we have to learn about the equivalent of a bachelor's degree every 10 years just to keep up, and more if we want to get ahead. So when moving in and out of learning is fluid and natural in your tool, you're able to get deeper and broader every day just by your natural work in that tool. PowerShell really excels at discoverability and it makes a big difference to my productivity. We all know that the Agile Sprint is a great way to test out new ideas, but what if you could take that right down to every line of code? Many shell environments have a lot of gotchas when it goes from going from the shell into code, and some of them don't even have a useful shell environment. In PowerShell, these both have parity. So everything works the same in both, which makes each a very good tool in its own right, but it also lets you prototype in the shell and drop that directly into code with 100% uh, guarantee it's going to work. So rapid iterations matter and PowerShell delivers in this area. Many shell languages output their information as text. We then have to parse this information back in order to make it into useful data that the next command can use. This process is fussy and frankly fragile. However, PowerShell deals with rich objects. When it retrieves data, it comes into objects, and the objects, methods, and data can be passed from command to command. So you can focus on really getting the problem solved rather than on fussy parsing and fragile code in production. Let's talk a little bit of innovation and standardization. Uh, Black & Decker had 120 power tools with a dizzying variety of motors. They decided to standardize on one, and they reduced their problems by 90% and their costs by 80%. They then innovated in tight cycles to push four competitors out of the market. So in reality, framework and component standardization actually fuels innovation and solutions. PowerShell has a very strong standardized structure under the covers, and so it has the same effect on the uh, uh, fueling innovation. Community matters as well, and PowerShell has had a strong community for well over 10 years, even before it was open sourced. Uh, this, this community has been sharing pluggable code and expertise through a variety of websites and events for a long time. This is not the first time that I've had this experience. Over 20 years ago with OS 400, we had the same powerful productivity, and that's because like PowerShell is built upon fundamentals about human cognition, innovation, learning, and so those same things come over uh, to PowerShell. I hope I've kind of demonstrated for you some of the things that make me more productive about PowerShell. Notice that they're not language specific. As I start working with PowerShell on Linux, I find the exact same benefits come right over into the Linux world. Uh, although I love PowerShell, I brushed off my bash skills and created a universal installer that will let you put it on any OSX or Linux distro that's supported. You can find it at installpowershell.com and I just encourage you to power up your penguin with PowerShell. <laughs>